Decorations on buildings throughout the city have already started to go up since before Republic Day. The most notable of the buildings, the Bank of Guyana, its five-story front decked with a large illuminated Guyanese flag, stands out for all to see. In addition, residents may have also noticed this morning that government buildings are adorned with a patriotic flair all throughout Georgetown. The mass decoration of the buildings transpired over the weekend. The Ministry of Tourism looked quite festive with flags, colorful curtains, and even banners with hand-painted scenes of Guyana lining the fence of the compound. Georgetown City Hall has also joined the gala festivities. Its grounds are also brightly decorated in commemoration of the Golden Jubilee. Thus far, the most highly decorated campus has to be that of the Guyana Revenue Authority. The Golden Arrowhead proudly hangs from the roof of the building and runs nearly the whole height of the building. Additionally, the fence is decorated with curtains that form the number 50. But the beautification does not end there. The section of Camp Street directly facing the building is also painted in the colors of the Guyanese flag. The patriotic decorations are not limited to government buildings. The Demerara Mutual Life Insurance Company, Caribbean Airlines, and many others have proudly adorned their buildings with the national colors. The national pride could even be felt outside of Georgetown. Not to be outdone, the Demerara Harbor Bridge Corporation also started flying Guyanese flags and national colors that can be seen all along the span of the 1.1 mile long bridge. Rihanna, as the 50th Independence Anniversary celebrations approaches, surely national pride is at an all-time high. 